In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use Chloe AI. If you find this video helpful, please consider to like this video and subscribe to my channel. In saying that, let's just jump straight into the video. Okay, so first thing what we need to do is make sure to go ahead and download and install Chloe onto your PC or laptop. So we need to open up a web browser and go to chloe.com. Now, once you're here, we need to go ahead and click on Get for Windows. And then once you've done that, a download should, should appear on your top right if you're using Google Chrome and it's about 200 megabytes in size. That's gonna download the setup installer. So you just give that a few moments to download. Okay, so once it's downloaded, go ahead and open it up. If it doesn't appear in your downloads, just go into your piece, into your files and look for it manually. So I'm just gonna open up the setup. All right, so here it is here. I'm just gonna minimize this window. Okay, so once you've done that, a little pop-up should appear that will say sign in with Google or you can use email instead. So I'm just going to sign in my Google account. All right, then from here, open up Chloe. Then from here, you got to see which one fits you best. So if you're looking for a job, student, curious or professional, click on one of those tabs. Then it might ask you a few more questions. And after that, you're going to appear on a page that looks like this. Now, once you open this up, you're gonna have a voiceover that's gonna tell you a little bit more about Chloe. So basically, Chloe AI is your invincible, invisible meeting assistant that listens, summarizes, and helps you respond in real time without ever joining the call or appearing to others. So basically what Chloe does, it's gonna give you real-time help, suggest what to say, questions to ask, or summaries while you're talking, automatic notes after every call, attendee insights. So before meetings, Chloe shows you profiles and your past conversation with each participant. And also they got invisible and private. So it never joins the meeting, never shows on screen share and never appears in call participant list, which is a good thing. Now from here, we want to go ahead and click on get started. So you can go ahead and connect your calendar with Google here. So I'm going to go ahead and connect my calendar. Now it's going to redirect to Google Chrome and sign me in, sign me into my calendar. All right, here we go. So I'm signed into my calendar. We've got um, the general tab here where we can play around the settings. So you can open Chloe when you log in. You've got theme. You can change your theme here to be light or dark. Also, we've got key binds here as well. So you can um, get all your keyboard shortcuts that you can set. You can view your profile. We can change our display name here. You've got language and obviously billing. If you want to go ahead and upgrade to a plan, you can. Now, what you want to do here is use the Cluely during meetings. So start your meeting in Zoom, Teams, Slack, WebEx, or any other platform. Cluely quietly runs in the background, so there's no bot, bot joins your call. And there's also a translucent floating window it appears over your meeting with what should I say, real-time suggestions for your next line of question, follow-up questions, so ideas to keep conversations moving, people search, so it shows attendee names, roles, and past chats. It can also type or speak naturally, so clearly updates live without interrupting your workflow. And you can also hide or minimize the overlay anytime and never shows it to hovers. Now, after the meeting is done, clearly automatically creates beautiful meeting notes with timestamps and summaries. It also drafts a follow-up email you can send immediately, and you can copy, edit, or export your notes straight from the Cluely dashboard. 